Hey, what's up, guys? How you doing? It is me, Lasty, here. Welcome today to a brand new episode of the FC24 Ultimate Team Road to Glory. It is episode number 53 today. Happy Sunday to you. Hope you're all doing all right. Uh, today is going to be jam-packed, as always. Um, we're going to do the Icon SBC. There's going to be some player unlocks. There's going to be some for champions. You name it. Basically, this episode has it all. So if you do enjoy, do me a favor. <clears throat> smash the thumbs up button. Uh, and of course, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new around here uh, and, and you're enjoying the content. <clears throat> so you can see the squad that I initially am um, thinking about heading on into the weekend league with. Uh, and that is simply because... Uh, I've bought Hansen, so Patry's in the squad. Uh, we've got Ramsdale that gives Kem to Declan Rice. Uh, you know, a couple of things here aren't absolutely perfect, but I think I can make it work. Uh, however, we are, of course, going to go ahead and do the Icon SBC. So hopefully we'll get someone that uh, is good enough to feature in the team. So let's get cracking with everything. Now, everybody got given an 83 times 3 for the start of the triple threat promo. So mine is this right here. Uh, I end up getting myself an 85 overall. Not gonna complain about that. A free uh, a, a free pack to get, you know, a little bit of fodder into the club. 85, 83, 83. Yeah, no complaints from me. Uh, and we also get ourselves a single draft token. And I think at some point a mega pack. Yeah, there's a mega pack uh, from, the, from the pro FC pro open thingy. Now, it's Saturday night at just gone 8 p.m. as I'm filming this video. Now, I've, I've just obviously I've been back from, from the Ipswich match for a couple of hours. We, have, we of course, won yesterday. Uh, I'd like joint top of the league. Only goal difference separates us and Leicester to the Premier League. Absolutely insane. Uh, but yeah, the, the, I, I don't know whether or not, or not the, the pro stuff that was drops enabled. Um, for us to earn packs and stuff. I don't know whether or not that was just during the day. I've got it on in the background here at the moment, uh, and I'm hoping that I'm earning drops, but I don't see anywhere that I am, and I figured I probably would see something. So I'm not too too confident that I'm earning free packs or XP or whatever it is you earn. Um, <clears throat> so we'll see about that after I've watched for a couple of hours and uh, see what it was. Uh, so that three-player Centurions pack, by the way, had an 88 and an 84 in it. You love to see stuff like that. It's not every day uh, you end up getting a, a decent one of those. Uh, and again, just, just from the little bits of fodder that I'm collecting, that's when I'm being able to get done with a, a new Centurions upgrade. Uh, and let's go ahead and put the squad together for the Icon SBC then, right? I hope the next time we get this, it, it goes up to like a minimum or a maximum 88 rated Icon. It would be nice to see a little bit of progression there. Uh, but what we have got in the club right now is the fodder to be able to do this SBC without any problems at all. I, genuinely, I've never built an Icon uh, SBC this quickly and easily without any thought or anything going into it before. It was, uh, it was, it was like too easy if anything uh the fact that it's only an 84 and an 85 rated squad is is a dub in my opinion uh but of course you need to to not waste that fodder you need to get an icon that is worthwhile so let's hope we can do that today one thing i am going to do is put my day one or week one uh lampty inform into this it was the last inform i had in my club and i believe team of the week players are like 25k right now um so yeah, I, I didn't want to spend the money, uh, but we have put Lamptey in. I don't ever envisage myself using him. Uh, I don't think he could have gone into like the newest uh, Evo. No, he couldn't. This is someone that can, though. Baku is one of the, the, the more sort of favored players to go into the latest Evo. But what did we get in our icon pack then? Well, you've seen the title of the video and the thumbnail. I said it's one of the better ones, and we end up getting the Italian right back icon. Uh... It's Zambrotta, ladies and gentlemen. That's a dub. That's a huge dub uh, because, one, he's very good. He's worth 480k or something like that. Uh, and two, uh, he is super versatile as a left back or a right back. So that's really, really good as well. Um, so now I've got this this weird decision of uh, I've got this triangle of very good players in Petit, Zambrotta, and Marcos Lorente. 
and they can pretty much all just sort of like switch around and stuff. So if if I want, I can play Petit as the CDM, uh, and then left back Zambrotta, right back Lorente. If I want to play Zambrotta at right back, I can do that. Put Lorente in midfield, and then Petit can play left back. So it's quite a interesting one. I might actually chop and change that around that during my weekend league to see what I'm enjoying the most. Um, so yeah, I'm. That, uh, it's another icon that goes into the team for sure. Uh, I didn't know whether or not I was going to be taking Petit out because at the time I had Patry in the squad and I wasn't sure if I needed her for Hansen's chemistry. But we figure it all out. Actually, with, uh, without any real issues, I figure it out. So only for now are we, uh, we taking Petit out. But once I bought a, a Norwegian manager and put the Spanish uh, female league manager item onto him... Uh, Hansen goes up to three bars of chemistry or three chem and, uh, and, and yeah, we're, we're, we're just sorted. So the only player I've got off chem there is Declan Rice. Oh, I feel like I'm going to sneeze. I had a steak with peppercorn sauce a little while ago and pepper normally makes me sneeze. So, uh, yeah, excuse me if that does happen. Um, but yeah, so, uh, I've now got enough icons in the squad that with the right manager in league, I can literally get a player without anybody else from that league into the squad on full chem. I love that. So that could be, uh, in, in terms of um, future squads, you know, this week we're using Hansen, uh, whose price has absolutely plummeted, by the way. I'm going to lose loads of money on her. Uh, it's sad knowing that I could have made like 80k on her um, an hour after I purchased the card. Uh, but unfortunately, yeah, the, the market has just fallen through its own behind and uh i'm losing loads of money currently on her which is what it is right it's just no big deal it's still i'm still going to be able to get let's say at least half a million coins for her uh even though i paid six four five uh, let me see right now actually what she's currently going for um hansen 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 let me spell that out 618 uh, and that is 8 p.m on saturday night so of course uh the problem will be that I'm not finishing my games until Sunday. At the time you're watching this, I'll hopefully be nearly done. And the market normally uh, falls even further. So, yeah, I reckon I'll sell her for end ending up being about 550k probably. Um, but we're still sat in like 300k coins in the club. Uh, if I can get like half a mil or whatever for her, we'll, we'll still be in a very, very good spot. And if I want to just choose a random player from a totally random league and stuff for next week, then... Um, as long as they're, I've got the right manager, nation, and league and stuff, and the right icons in the squad, I can literally get them into the team without even worrying. So that is awesome. Um, I love that. I actually, I like that icons do help for for that side of things this year. It's been a lot more, a lot more useful than they were last year. That's for sure. People definitely uh, preferred heroes last year to icons because they were so useful. Uh, talking of heroes, uh, we obviously have the latest, uh, the, the triple threat. Promo is has been here for a couple of days now. Um, the I, I quite like the thought of uh, of, of the the English hero, obviously like Ledley King has been given a nice upgrade. Uh, he's got a triple threat hero card. Uh, I quite like the thought of potentially getting him in and maybe dropping Ed Militao. I would guess I can't drop Blanc, right? He's he's too good, but Ed Militao's too good as well. But I'm thinking Ledley King does look very, very good. Uh, and then also, of course, there's the SBC for Ashley Neville, which we're now about to complete. An 83 rated squad uh, for her. And I had the 85. I, mean, I ended up putting an 86 into this. I put Trent in. Um, but Ashley Neville looks uh, actually like a really good card. If you if you apply a chem style, and like if you put a, a shadow onto this this card right here, uh, she's like a 90 rated fullback and would have like 92 pace and 94 defending, something like that. And then and she's got some good play styles for, for being a defender as well. So I think her in either right back or in the DM sort of role could work out a real treat. Um, bit of a strange hairdo on, on this card right there. And, and, you know, but it is what it is. Uh, we'll move on into, what is this? This must be a reward pack for something. Maybe it's another three-player pack. I was surprised to see a player that's only 82 rated have a playstyle plus. But I think there's silvers with that as well. Especially like the long throw-in one. There must be players down the leagues that have uh, 
that have really long throws, right? The the Rory Delap uh, esque players, but that, that are playing in like League Two. Um, so I'd done some more stuff offline, a, aka squad battles, to work on Madison, work on my Evo for Depay, and work on just the general. There's still Centurions. Uh, play this many games get wins in this many games and, and then you end up keep getting like these quite nice packs so i'm doing that and getting an 81 double every now and again and stuff so that's quite good that's what's filling the club up with fodder by the way uh, like right here we get an 85 rated um kieran trippier uh it's great uh, i'll go into another sbc uh one thing i am lacking now obviously is then informs so if I could start packing the random Team of the Week players in these, that would be good. Uh, or, of course, promo players would be very nice. I'd quite like to pack a uh, uh, a nice triple threat card. If, we're, if we can get, like, triple threat Ginola, that would be... Uh, it's not much to ask, but if we could get that, I'd be fairly happy. Um, <laughs> anyway, time for some champs. So I've literally just got done playing these. Uh, I... I had about, you know, 10, 11 minutes worth of footage for, for your video here today. And I was like, well, when I get back from football, I need to play my first five games of champs and then edit the video for you. So uh, that's what we're going to add on here. My first five games of the weekend league. Um, I rushed into it and uh, I don't know what to say. Um, this first game right here, I couldn't work out. It was in, it was about mid second half that I, real, that I started thinking, all right, this guy's quite good at the game. Uh, because at this point, I thought I'd got unlucky to be 2-1 down. And we fairly easily got ourselves an equaliser and stuff. Um, but, yeah, I, I, I got into the second half. And some of the movements and uh, and stuff that this person was doing. And, like, holding possession really well and stuff. And the RB dribbling here and there. And I was just like, yeah, you know what? Maybe they are competent. Uh, and I do deserve to be losing this one right here. That was a nice goal there from uh, Garnacho, I think it was. So, yeah, I, I, I got absolutely battered in the end because I end up going like, what is it, like 5-2 down here? Uh, this is also another thing, isn't it? That back post, that exact corner technique is one thing that uh, really does work well. The, the play it short and then whip it to the back post to someone who knows how to head the ball. Um, so I was 5-2 down, first game of the entire weekend league, though, so I felt like I wasn't going to quit. Uh, I would see it out and see, you know, just again try and warm up because it's the first game of the, uh, the for the for a couple of days um <clears throat> and i ended up getting two goals back really 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 late on uh, so of course once it was 5-4 and he kicked off he just kept the ball which i don't blame him whatsoever for doing uh, there was no time for me to really get a fifth goal but it was quite encouraging that we got a, a couple of goals right at the end there it felt like it, it did help me by staying in that game to warm up just a bit um and then we go into this match and i get jared bowen right off the well, a few minutes into the game. Uh, and then look at this for a weird, weird strike from Hansen. I don't know what that was all about, but it flew into the back of the net. So we'll take it. And that gets me an equalizer. And then Jetson Fernandez scores. Uh, I make a couple of changes straight after that because I just didn't feel like Petit was playing very well. Uh, or I think maybe like Alawairan. I can't quite remember. But at 3-1 down, I do quit that one. And I'm Norton too. In the weekend league, everyone. Maybe I've rushed into it. Maybe I wasn't ready to play it. But either way, I'm Norton too. So it's only it can only either get a lot worse from here, or it can go up from here. Hopefully, can we finish three and two for the day, please? Um, a, a very nice person decided to give me a win. They obviously felt so bad that I was uh, zero for two uh, in in the weekend league that they decided to give me a free win. So I very much appreciate that. Thank you. Uh, my next opponent has done. Madison's objective already and unlock Neville as well. Didn't notice if they had Ledley King actually. Oh, I think they do in the in the centre back role there. Uh, but I go one nil up literally off of kickoff. I go on a little RB Maisy run with with Rodrigo, uh, score that one, and then I green time the shot, but he saves it, and then the, they pause and quit. So I went from naught and two to two and two in literally about three real life minutes. It was uh, it happened really really quickly. So then I just had this game to go for, uh, to finish off the video. And um, hopefully we can finish on a positive note. So Rodrigo puts me 1-0 up. Nice one. Took 17 minutes, but we uh, we got the goal. Uh, Hansen then goes ahead and makes it two after 25 minutes. So I'm in control. I'm fully in control here. Should be all good. Uh, and then Rodrigo gets one just four minutes later. We are 3-0 up and cruising. Uh, but then my opponent scores that. <laughs> Hell of a goal from Hugh Minson. That finesse shot plus is crazy, isn't it? Um, but 
we get a fourth just before half time. Into the second half we go. I wondered when my opponent maybe thought about rage quitting. Uh, and it turns out that 6 1 was, uh, was going to be uh, enough. We scored two. In, uh, in four minutes of the second half starting. So, uh, yeah, we get a nice 6-1 victory to round off the video here. So at least I am 3-2. and two. We were we were 0-2. We've gone to 3-2. and two. Uh, Hopefully when I play my 15 games that uh, whilst you're watching this video, probably uh, it will go nice with, nicely for me and I can end up with 11. Uh, but I do imagine this to be a very sweaty weekend because I think a lot of the casual user base... Uh, are probably playing COD or Fortnite right now. Uh, we get Jota and Kim Min Jae in that pack right there. And then uh, we actually end up getting ourselves a Harry Kane in the next pack. That's a big dub. Uh, that's a 90 rated piece of fodder right there. Uh, so, yeah, I, I was I was over the moon uh, about getting that because that's going to make some SBC a lot cheaper. And there's an inform in there as well. Really, really good 83 double, that one. Or 82 double, whatever it was. It was a very, very good... Uh, reward pack i'll take it so um that's gonna end the episode for you for today if uh, if you have enjoyed please do me a favor smash the thumbs up let's really try and get this video into the algorithm let the let the people see it uh and of course don't forget to subscribe to the channel as well if you're new thank you come follow me on social media twitter insta tiktok all of that stuff down below i think i'm gonna start ramping up the short form content again uh so uh definitely come follow me over there if you don't already have a great day everyone Enjoy your Sunday. If you've got any more champs to play, good luck to you. I hope you get your uh, desired wins or I hope you get really good rewards. I don't care how many wins you get. I just hope you get good rewards. Uh, hey, I'll be back tomorrow. I look forward to seeing you then. Peace.